Her Excellency Do Aung San Suu Kyi, State Councillor of the Republic of the Union of Myanmar. Dear guests, His Excellency Mr. Cho Win, His Excellency Mr. King Mountain, His Excellency Mr. Train Tanjin, Mr. Cho Zeya, Mr. Koko Nain, Mr. Win Cho Aung, Mr. Myo Tampe, Mr. Aung Kain Tun, His Excellency Mr. Tateshi Higuchi, His Excellency Mr. Yoichi Suzuki, Mr. Ichiro Maruyama, Mr. Tetsuji Miyamoto, Mr. Hiroshi Yoshimoto. We gather today to award Her Excellency Do Aung San Suu Kyi with the, the honorary degree of doctor for her contributions to the advancement of democracy in Myanmar and in the world as a whole. Do Aung San Suu Kyi in Kyoto, we highly value warm relations between people. And so I hope you, you will not mind if we affectionately call you Suu Kyi san. Throughout her fight for democracy, Suu Kyi san has endured many hardships. She res resisted the military government in her country through non-violent means and led the National League for Democracy even while under house arrest for over 15 years. Her efforts were certainly not in vain. During the elections in 2015, the National League for Democracy was supported by a great majority, and that support led to a peaceful transfer of power and a shift to a more civilian-based political system. Today, in her role of state councillor, Su Chi San leads the construction of a more integrated society and the implementation of economic reforms for her country's rapid development. The gradual pacification of historic ethnical grievances and the lifting of 20-year long sanctions in October are very clear evidence of progress that is being made. Suji san inspires people all around the world who are engaged in the fight for democracy. Her efforts also deepen awareness among those who currently enjoy basic human rights, and she has demonstrated that such rights must be attained and maintained with determination, responsibility, and strength of mind. From a young age, she strove for the advancement of her country, and part of her career took place here at Kyoto University. From 1985 to 86, she was engaged in research at our Center for Southeast Asian Studies. Her research focused on her father, General Aung San, commitment to advancing freedom and unity in her then newly independent country. Since that time, Su Chi San has honored us with a previous visit in 2013, when she was awarded the title of Honorary Fellow of Kyoto University. And we are delighted to welcome her here again today to receive her honorary doctorate. To date, Kyoto University has conferred 13 honorary doctoral degrees on outstanding scholars for their scientific contributions in various fields. This is the first time that the university has conferred such an honorary degree on an individual for their commitment to freedom, 
democracy and human rights. This honorary degree expresses the respect that Kyoto University holds for Suchi san's work and achievements which resonate with the university's guiding principles that encourage freedom of thought and the promotion of a harmonious global society. Suchi san, you are a tremendous inspiration not only to our students, faculty, and staff, but to people everywhere. In appreciation of your outstanding ac accomplishments, I am delighted to award you on behalf of Kyoto University with this honorary degree of doctor. Thank you very much. So, we will now proceed with the awarding of the honorary doctorate. I'd like to invite Her Excellency Do Aung San Suu Kyi to the podium. Your Excellency, please. Kyoto University has conferred on Aung San Suu Kyi the honorary degree of doctor for her outstanding contribution to the advancement of science and culture. In testimony thereof, the undersigned has affixed it the seal of the university. Witness my hand this third day of November 2016. Juichi Yamagiwa, President, Kyoto University. Congratulations. Now, we'd like to present Her Excellency Do Aung San Suu Kyi with the honorary academic store. And now, I'd like to ask Her Excellency to say a few words. <laughs> 